How many of us have ever prayed this prayer? Lord, grant me patience and give it to me right now. You've heard that phrase, right? We want the Lord to give us patience, but we want it immediately. We know James in our devotional today in chapter five talks about patience when he says these words in verses seven through nine. Be patient, therefore, brothers, until the coming of the Lord. See how the farmer waits for the precious fruit of the earth, being patient about it until he receives the early and late rains. You also be patient. Establish your hearts for the coming of the Lord. You know, I, I love that phrase. There's a, there's a lot of information in there about being patient and waiting, but listen to that phrase. Establish your hearts and wait for the coming of the Lord. You know, that, that's good advice for us every single day that we should dwell in the richness of God. Be patient, wait on God, wait for His return. Live every day as He's about to return, but live for today knowing that God is in control of all things. Be patient and wait on the Lord. Let's pray together. Thank you, Lord, for your word as it continues to teach us. I, I pray today for every one of us, beginning with me, God, that you would uh, teach us and grant us patience, that we would be willing to be patient with others, and that we would be grateful for your patience with us. Thank you, Father, for the gift of loving us. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.